Well, hello everyone. Here is Sherry right here for JC Dugard here for spring 2017, right here for the year 2017. And uh, this right here actually shows right here are some paintings I went and put together right here. Have right here is like a, you know, this is a drawing, you know, photo right here that uh, I worked, you know, in Photoshop right here, you know, for young Dugard right here for, uh, you know, this is, you know, for July 17th of 2017. So I got that date written right there. And you have right here is like a heart symbol right here. And I can go ahead and zoom in a little bit right here, but uh, but you see right here is that the main reason why I want to talk about this activity is talking about sensitive delight. So I know that most of us have seen uh, from um, those uh, like what's called a special scene you know, for 2020 is to where it talks about is to where it uh, you know feeling uh, you know old and young and as well as for sensitive delight. And uh, if anybody warns is that yeah that uh, you may uh, you know. <laughs> Feel that way sometimes as to where, yeah, that, uh, you know, if you, you know, like, uh, you know, anybody who's going to be uh, going through those traumatic, you know, hard times and ordeals, that uh, they are going to be what you call experiences to where that, uh, you know, they feel like that they have uh, been around for quite some time and uh, maybe that, uh, you know, if anything about what you call abuse or if any, you know, anything like that about how they survived and is for freedom, though. But I want to, you know, talk about right here are these um, photos uh, about this this drawing right here that uh, for about how many of us can remember how old we we were when we first touched the American flag. I'm like the American flag and having your picture taken, when you're sitting on the American flag or being around the American flag or holding the American flag. <laughs> and uh, if most of us, I like, say that yeah, that uh, that. Uh, from back whenever I was about maybe eight years old, or if anybody say that, yeah, you're going to be maybe ten years old, and then think it is to where that you for how old you're going to be uh, whenever you experience a lot of stuff. And I also want to point out right here is a shadow. So if anybody say, yeah, there's going to be a shadow visible from a certain angle whenever you're going to have a picture taken, or that yeah, there's going to be certain light within a distance from a you know, from a certain angle or so that uh, have a picture taken, or that if you want to go in. A, you say, yeah, that the, what does a shadow necessarily represent? And that that's supposed to be what you call maybe a reflection or something that represents as to where that, you know, it's something to where that, because um, I know a, a way I used to call it as to where if you're going to see a shadow, it, it basically means as to where that, yeah, that uh, to where that uh, something about your image that makes it to, yeah, if you want to call it special or if like anything or say for artistic and like with anything, you know, any anybody that may say, oh, of course, anything that you draw freehand is, I say, known as artistic and special. But um, still, if you're going to have be taking a photo or something, and then take this toward it, what you think about from there. But you see, right here is a with this right here. I use the Photoshop work right here. So if anybody warns is that, yeah, your Photoshop work, any editing that you do, and you pretty much put whatever you want in there. But then whenever you take a photo. It basically captures about what you, know, you see and then uh, from what uh, is able to uh, develop and you know, like the final turnout as well. But um, but anyway, uh, but you see right here, I want to you know, show everybody real quick right here of uh, this right here. Let's talk about you know for the heart right here. I'll go ahead and zoom in a little bit. Yeah, right here is like for the young Dugart right there for sensitive delight. And then um, I want to show everybody here. I mean, you know this right here. Would be is to where that uh, sense of the delight in the stars in the sky, love that brings the hugs and, and kisses in the heart. You know, reading uh, the story about freedom helps readers understand more about you know, for J C Dugard. And um, so I know that uh, more likely if I'm gonna be uh, using some of this, it's like for anybody to say that yeah, that you know, for being a, a book reader and uh, anything that you read about necessarily, and think oh yeah, sense of delight and. You may think it's to worry, yeah, that you know, if you feel like that, you know, you're feel old, or maybe that uh, you know, feel like say that, yeah, do you feel young or old, and and uh, you know, if you're if you're gonna be very sensitive to life, and sometimes I feel by saying this to her, really that um, you know that anybody who's gonna maybe be a uh, in their, their mid thirties or so, uh, would maybe say something like as to where they feel old, but it's like really that um, they may uh, think as you know, that necessarily, but still that uh, I guess that, that basically means as to you know, any, anybody who's gone through uh, a lot of traumatic uh, situations in life, it's a uh, it's a uh, which call anything about abuse or if it's anything uh, you know like what you call you know for hard times, but. Um, 
Still, though, that you know, putting you know, use these these paintings right here, these illustrations, and then also uh, think about it's like you know details from the book also talk about for freedom, and uh, really that uh, you know uh, for anything about what you call artistic that I try to use, and I mainly want to talk about you know, for sensitive delight. Because like anybody like say for J.C. Dugard that uh, she's going to experience a lot about you know about the backyard and then, uh, being around the sunlight especially and uh, you know whenever you deal with those sit uh, had those situations to where you're going to be very sensitive to light and um, what does that basically mean is to where that uh, sometimes that uh, that you were to where maybe why. Uh, your skin and maybe your your hair or something that you know, it tends to change color as well, and uh, maybe that uh, if anybody warns us to where that there's a, you know, a a chance of maybe getting sunburned or maybe if it's anything uh, related to anything about what's called anything uh, you know about you know, you know anything about the skin color or something like that. But you know, anyway, uh, but to talk about you know, talk about here for sensitive delight, and uh, if anybody warns us that uh, anything. Uh, Related to uh, the writing skills, and I was uh, looking at this right here, and uh, while I was painting this, and then it's like you know this right here will be you know, young J C Duke right here, but uh, have right here is like a talk about you know, for writing the story. So this right here will be like maybe like some notes. Anybody say yeah? If you go from uh, from page to page and go to different chapters to say of the book, and then uh, maybe that you would. Uh, have like a little Valentine heart right here just to show us thing about is to where that, that anybody who's going to be going to those those uh, dramatic uh, situations and uh, think is to where yeah that uh, if you think about it is to where that uh, you feel like you've been around for a very long time you feel old but uh, really about how old is too old just to be able to hold the American flag huh <laughs> really that um, anybody that may want to worry about that how old were you whenever you first held the American flag but um, but I also uh, want to mention right here is to where that these uh, the, this Photoshop work right here is it uh, it's like for an American flag and uh, I'm sure most of us you know, who are you know Americans will maybe say is to where if it's you know, anybody you know, for any country that uh, you're gonna be holding a flag about how old is too old really to be uh, known as to be honored and uh, for like say if it's going to be a trophy or if it's anything like such as a medal though as to where that uh, anything uh, related to it like for honors though but um, but uh, anyway uh, talk about right here got right there is that and then uh, yeah, right here is for you know, for young uh, you know, JCD got right there but uh, for, for spring 2017 so I know if anybody wants is that yeah that um, yeah for you know, ever since the new year are you going to be you know, working anything uh, about, say, for talk about for J.C. Dugard, you know, for freedom, and then uh, talk about for sensitive delight, and knowing about really about, you know, you know that uh, it seems like it's toward that you, uh, that, you know, even though if you feel like that you're getting old, and then, uh, you know, it's like, yeah, that, um, you know, you're, you're afraid to look in the mirror or anything like that, but still, that, uh, just try to think about as to where the, yeah, about, you know, shadow right here, and think about as to where for what we see whenever we do look in the mirror. Do we look at, you know, do we look at ourselves as toward it? Uh, yeah, if anybody say whenever you do uh, look in the mirror, do you see uh, somebody who is very educated and very bright and in it for a bright future ahead of them or just knowing about? Because I know with me though that uh, I keep thinking as toward, yeah, somebody like me, yeah. <laughs> You know, uh, somebody like me with a disability, you would think that I'm very restricted to a lot of things. It's like for how I learn compared to everybody else, and see the thing about it's where, yeah, you're not even qualified for a number of things. Then more likely than anybody probably considered you as to where we'd call you know, superstar or any, anything like that. But uh, for like, you know, anything really to like, you know, spring artwork or anything like that, or anything uh, really to use in programs. But um, anyway, uh, but they have a talk about for JCD Garden for spring 2017. You know, thanks for watching and have a great day.